Me and Sister TV. Y'all tap in with a boy. Big thing smoking on YouTube, so I ain't lying. Like, comment, subscribe. Man, tell somebody so they tell somebody about the boy, man. Brought y'all back in the thing with me. You feel me? Last night, big night. I pulled out for the first time. Held out for about four hours. Me and my big dog. Shout out to that boy. If he would never call me, I would have never pulled it out. So, but I'm glad I did pull it out. I'm glad I did pull it out. I ran it. It done strong. I think it's stronger than my old motor, accelerate faster, and just everything. Everything that just built. But like I said, it's already a, it's, it's a street motor. It's just a strong street motor. You feel me? Big stroke kick in the bottom end. Stroke the motor. You know how I kick it. But um, we had one issue, though. We had one issue. It kept bogging. It kept bogging. It kept bogging down on me when I come to a light. So um, it's crazy because when Mill Center was adjusting my car rate, it did the same thing. And when he was here, he was running fine, then it just bogged down and just died. He said, I'm gonna get, get some trash and got it in my car already. He cleared it out, got it back running, and it was fine. So when he left, I crunked it back up. He did the same thing. I let it start, then I crunked it back up. It was fine. So in the back of my head, I always had that in the back of my head. I might run into the problem again. Last night, I did. Last night, I did. We was on our way to the script. And um, what I had did, man, my bitch, I had pulled over and bumped the idol up. But the idol was up so high when I got on the script, I couldn't even goose it like I really wanted to, but I just didn't want it to cut off. But that's the last thing you want to do. You'll call it cut off at the script. Then you and your homeboy got to push it. Just in a, I just want you to have none of that. But long story short, I drove last night. I drove last night. I find out what problems I do got. Oh, damn, my phone put me in. I ain't even heard it load up. But yeah, I find out what problems I got. I find out what problems I got. And now, I may have to link back up. When we link back up, um, we link back up, we just gotta um we just gotta fix it. Tell y'all did tell y'all did way real quick. I ain't really doing that major though. I ain't doing that major. I just put my little vacuum, my little vacuum thing. A little um vacuum port back on the little vacuum hole. Cause we were just trying to see that I have um well vacuum the problem, anything like that, but now they ain't had nothing to do with it. It's inside the carburetor. Inside the carburetor, some trash or something, whatever it is, we're gonna get it figured out. But well, um, I really can get back to doing what I need to do. But the car is a major key, a major key in it. Come on, now, what the hell you act like you wanna go there? Y'all, hold on. I'm trying to put this vacuum hose up there. Y'all, I'm gonna check my oil. I'm just, I'm checking over a lot of stuff. I'm checking over a lot of stuff right now. Checking over a lot of stuff. Checking over a lot of stuff right now. Just to check my oil. Check, check everything. Cause like I said, I drove last night. I drove last night for the um. I drove last night for the first time. I drove last night for the first time. So it was a big night for real, for real. You know what I'm saying? Seeing what problems I got, if I got any problems. And I'm just glad I did, because today I actually was gonna wash put some clothes on the ride. But I would have been mad as hell if that stuff would have happened. Well I had my clothes on this night. So that was last night was more like a it was more like a test run just to see what we get. More like a test run. Okay. Oil still, oil still good, dog. Remember the last time I checked the oil on the motor? That jump was up on the dip stick, boy. Was a bad day. Was a bad day, but you seen what I did about it. Snatched that ass right up out of here. Got up out of here. Okay. <laughs> burn no oil, bro. That's a good thing, bro. Don't burn no oil. So, yup, yeah, other than that, other than, other than that little issue, as far as, um, other than that little issue going on with the carburetor, that trash getting, man, this time running fine. I can't ask for that better. Now when I'm figuring it, I'm figuring it lay on that ground back there and see what side wrenches I need just in case we had to crack that frill frill open and blow it out of however it's gonna go. You feel me? I'm gonna figure it do that though. So I'm gonna put y'all on power, put y'all in position. And I'm gonna tell y'all something out. They're gonna help everybody out there. 
They got an old school. What I'm finna show you, that'll prevent you for, from losing a $20,000 car, 30, 40, 50 racks, however many racks you got in your car. I'm gonna show you some cheap that gonna save you from goddamn losing your whole car. Y'all hold it for a minute. And I advise anybody who got an old school, listen to when I tell you this, dog. You need to get one of these in your car and have them handy. But I'm telling you, you do not want to lose your car and not have a $20 part in there that'll save you. I'm putting you down on this one right here, dude. Thank me later. This right here, fire extinguisher. Y'all better put one of these in your car. I, I watched a lot of videos before I finally grabbed me one. I, lost a, I watched a lot of videos of niggas, I mean, of dudes who got their cars, of dudes who got old school, and maybe they still want to put in right or or whatever it was, but they caught fire and they didn't have this, lost the whole goddamn car. So for anybody out there with an the old school, y'all do me a favor, you don't take nothing else from my video. Put a fire extinguisher in your car, dog. Put a fire extinguisher in your car and make sure you're on the safe side, dude. But I keep that gentleman dead. Really? I keep that gentleman on dead. So yeah, now you gotta call, man. Put a fire extinguisher in there. So yeah, y'all, come on. So yeah, right now, I'm just under here checking out my fear of so I can see what size I need. Um, we're gonna be taking that off real soon. I gotta make sure there ain't no dirt. I gotta make sure there ain't no dirt. I gotta make sure there ain't no um no dirt on my fur put the extra claws up for real, for real. Like I said, that jump my dog, it getting in my way dog. That's exactly what I'm finna get ready to do. I'm finna get ready to um I'm finna get ready to go grab me some tools, some wrenches. That's all I need is a few wrenches. Deep joints too. All that I need is a free wrench and maybe an adjustable wrench too. So I can um crack it loose real quick. See what's going on. That's exactly what I'm gonna do. Have it already ready. When Mr. Simpson, when, when, when Mr. Simpson come down here, I can already have it ready though. So y'all hold on. Oh yeah, for y'all who haven't seen it. Yeah, that's what we got going on, dog. Y'all yeah, remember these boys, don't you? 110, dog. I still actually got that 110 in that tank, too. 110 bit from that 93. But as I run the last bit of that 110 out, I'll be back. Pump, gas pump shot. I can pull up. And put me some, um, put me some regular 93 in it. So I ain't gonna lie, I ain't gonna miss. I ain't gonna miss, goddamn, going out there buying that five gallons of this right here and missing it. I ain't gonna miss that at all, you feel me? I did it. I thought I was gonna keep on doing it because I ain't thought that motor was gonna go out, but now that I'm back pump gas, shit, I don't got no problem with that. I still got down to the same amount of power, maybe even more. Can't get no better than that, dog. Oh, yeah, I'm probably gonna get ready to, um, probably gonna get ready to go down. I'm trying to see, do I wanna do it now? I do I wanna wait because I ain't even show y'all the, the inline frill filter because I ain't had my flag light, so it would have been dog. So I ain't even waiting my time. I ain't even my time. But, um. Well, yup. Yeah, I was just basically hollering at y'all for real. Let you know how the first the first drive, the first chair drive went. Pulling this thing out. I don't got no leak. Transmission sealed up. Motor good. Motor strong. We just have one issue. And that issue is that, um. Whatever getting in that carburetor. So, it's either trash or something. But we're gonna figure it out, though. Figure it out. And get back to doing. Get back to doing what I need to do out here, dog. Promote that page, you feel me? That's, the only, that's my only concern right now, promote that page, dog. It doing what it doing, but I didn't know I gotta um, get to some more car show and I gotta get the car to the car show. Once I get to a car show, they gonna do what they gonna do, my boy. For real. But yup, this ain't gonna be no long, dog. I basically came and holler at y'all, let y'all know what was going on. Uh, after the first drive, drove last night. And the only issue I had was that um, it's some getting in my car, right? A clock, some trash, or whatever it is, causing it to continue to dump fuel, dump gas in the jump. And Bill Simpson said it's some, some trash or some not letting them needle close enough. So he's gonna come down here soon, and um, 
I might go ahead and um, get that footage right there to us. Us got now doing our process to try to get it all the way right. Cause like I said, you can we can clear it out, it'll run fine, then it'll end up doing it again. But you know, it's an old school like that. Like I said, I'm gonna show you all angles. All angles, good, bad, and the ugly. What it take to, to get them right, the little problems you have in between. You know, it's getting these carburetors right, there's all that. So I ain't gonna, uh, I ain't gonna shop to nowhere. You know, I ain't, I don't hide that. But what, I do this for real. I don't, the people who gonna hire some, the people, the people who are hiring stuff, to me, is the people who ain't doing it for real. You know what I'm saying? They put on an act with me. I'm gonna show you all the way around the board. And I ain't gonna just show you me riding in the joint, putting Instagram videos up there, snapping pills and all that right there. Now nah, I'm gonna show you what's going on when the camera not rolling, you feel me? I'm gonna show you what the problem that the boy be running into, trying to get that joint right. So, um, like I said, I'm gonna get him down here. We're gonna figure that out. Figure that out. Now that I know I don't got no more issues besides that, the power with them, port them, sound them, everything I need, only but that. So I ain't even tripping about that because I know we're gonna, we're gonna, um, we're gonna fix that real soon. So then, after that, it'll be time to get that merge to put in here. Like I said, I had appointment, I had appointment Saturday at 10 30 when they opened, but um, 10 o'clock I had a call and I was like, dog, it's raining, it's about to start raining. And I'm probably gonna rescale because I ain't coming out of that rain. That boy Dark Vader. I'll show you something. That boy Dark Vader back there. He don't do good with that rain, dog. He don't do good with that rain at all. That's what I told him. I'm just gonna um, I'm just gonna rescale that thing. He had already told me it's raining on the end. He already told me it's raining on the end with it, so. I might not want to come down though, so um, that's where we at with that too. Get the sister put in, I'm gonna get the carpet put in, the HID, that really ain't that big on my my um, priority list, cause I got them, I'll get them put in sooner or later. Let me see. Let me see, the carpet out of the system. The carpet out of the system. I still got line lock on deck. Still got line lock on that. I ain't really um big on putting that in here right now because I ain't really hoping nobody don't tell me to burn out because I ain't trying to burn out. I, ain't, I just want to cruise. I want to just relax and ride, my boy. But they're going to get put in sooner or later. Ain't no big issue right now. So that's what we got going on. You know what I'm talking about? I'm going to put y'all in on all corners of these cars. All of like, everything was going on from the motor locking up, putting a new motor in, driving a new motor. Was it fine? You had issues. Yeah, we did have, I did have an issue or two. Uh, some getting in the carburetor, but we're gonna figure that out. And I'm gonna be back to it. I can't wait till I get back to that part where I had no problem, dog, cause that part right there, I love it. Even with my old motor for that valve drop, I was at a part where I had no motor. My 355, I had no issue with that joint. I just used to ride it for hours, dog. But that's what I'm trying to get back to it. But I didn't know when I do die, that was all the end where I needed to be at for the carburetor, no trash, no nothing. They're gonna be a fun little squeak motor right here, cause man, they just fun. We rolling them just like at night. We rolled them just like I said, it, it, it accelerated, car, it moved the car so fast, dog. I was like, damn. It was kind of like, it was a good thing that that, I ain't say it was a good thing that the motor went out, but I, I really like this. I'm glad I got a chance to actually put this one in. I like this John dog. So I'm about to get on up out of here and miss it TV. Y'all tap in with the boy. Best thing smoking on YouTube, shout out Iron Line. Like, comment, subscribe. Man, tell somebody, tell somebody, tell somebody about the boy, man. I wait four to five. Bring it down to Center Clay County in my neck of the wood back home, baby. Keep tapping in, keep subscribing, keep telling folks about the page. And man, we're gonna continue to slowly ride to the top. You feel me? Those who got down grinding for real, sometimes the success don't come overnight. But the mission is just to stay focused and keep going towards it, baby. I'm out there, thank y'all bees out there.